Senator Bernie Sanders a few days ago held a uh, discussion. Uh, uh, it was in, I believe it was in Michigan. Uh, and uh, it was a panel of uh, different people speaking about the coronavirus. And we know that uh, Bernie Sanders, uh, if you've been paying attention, he does want the vaccine, and which we're a long ways off from the vaccine by all accounts. We're over a year away from a vaccine even being made uh, for this coronavirus. Mm -hmm. But still, he wants this vaccine to be at no cost to the American people. So um, at this event, uh, he's being asked. You're not going to be able to hear the reporter, but uh, at the beginning, the reporter asked him uh, if he does believe that the vaccine should be free. And he says, absolutely, I believe. Uh, And then right after that, the reporter asks, how are we going to pay for it? And that's where you're going to see uh, the response, not just from Bernie Sanders, but from Uh, Deborah Berger, who is the president of the National Nurses United, and also Dr. Allison Galvani, who is from the Yale School of Medicine. Absolutely. (laughs) Well, I... I was growing up, we got the polio vaccine for free and nobody asked how you pay for it because what they saw were children in iron lungs that were going to be damaged forever. How, how insane and cruel is it to suggest that we have to figure out how to pay for it when we can actually go to war and not ask one question but to prevent this kind of a disease we have to say how can we pay for it that i'm sorry i I, (laughs) yeah the cost of not paying for the vaccine is going to be orders of magnitude much more expensive Do I approve of spending a few cents for a vaccine rather than seeing people die or spending thousands of dollars on hospital care? Yeah, I kind of think it makes a a little bit more sense to invest a few cents in a vaccine. We know what this question is about. Um, Whenever we're talking about (laughs) for the betterment of people, not, 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 not a certain segment of people, we're talking about every people. All people. We're talking about poor people, middle class people. Usually those are the people we're talking about. The vulnerable people. The vulnerable people. Disenfranchised communities. People that actually need assistance. Uh, When we're talking about those people, whenever you're talking about a cost, a program that is for those people. I mean, it's for everybody, but specifically, like, you know, again, these people need assistance. Mm -hmm. When we're talking about those programs, the, the question always is, from the media, from politicians, uh, from everybody. How are we going to pay for it? We never asked how we're going to pay for a number of different things like corporate subsidies, how we're going to pay for war. You heard that brought up. Never is the case. But to save American lives, the subject is how are we going to pay for it? Again, and you heard the response, what is going to be the cost of not paying for it? How, like, why are we not just initially, initially just looking at this as an investment? Like we should be talking about with, I don't know, healthcare and I don't know, education in this country. If we want to build a society where we are the innovators and we are doing things so that this economy is strong and going forward, it progresses to even a, 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 just a greater strength, then we would make investments in people in this country. So that they can lead to better outcomes for this nation. The Fed just is, is pumping in trillions of dollars right now to prop up the market. You, because you, talk, you talked about that, right? The, this is a headline, all right. This is a headline that uh, Mike sent me earlier. Fed to pump in more than one trillion dollars in dramatic ramping up of market intervention amid coronavirus meltdown. So you, you talked about how the, the Dow Jones, quick. all the, the markets tumbling, crashing. Plummeting. Earlier today, the uh, uh, trading had to be suspended for, what, 15 minutes because it was plummeting so fast. So fast. fast. Hey, but maybe these, you know, this Dow Jones industrials need to uh, pick themselves up by their bootstraps. And not get assistance. And not, you know, and stop expecting free stuff from the government. Yeah, handouts. Uh, handouts. Welfare. Yeah. I do uh, like I do like the attitude that was shown. Yeah, discuss. Discuss. Like, excuse me. Like, yeah. how yeah. dare you ask about the what, how much is going to cost? Because it's how talking about it's this? talking about monetary costs and not like uh, the 
cost in regard to lives. Yeah. That should be the most important cost they're looking at. It should be. But, but I guess those people design. are worthless. Yeah. Not just talking of about, um, you know, people who can't afford it, but you also have prison populations. Yeah. You also have homeless populations. So I guarantee you, if those people go neglected, it will affect all of us. 